Hello, so we are back. But this time, let's review a polarized light versus a normal microscope light. I was waiting to do this review for a long time. So, the best way to understand what's going on here if, is if, if, if you know something about the dynamic range, yeah, camera dynamic range. And uh, if you know about camera dynamic range, you know all what is matter in a camera is the dynamic range. It, you know, the pixels, the things, it doesn't matter, you know, the resolution. No, the, the dynamic range. So the quality of the camera is based on the, the, the dynamic range of that camera. Because of the dynamic range, you will understand buying a cheap camera like I did. Yeah, so you remember we bought... Uh, a camera from eBay, I, around, around, I paid, I think, around 80 pounds for this camera. And uh, you cannot expect to perform like a 600 pounds camera. How much is the Amscope camera or the, the one from the Cambridge Optics was the same, like around 600. So that's the price for, uh, for a good camera, 600 pounds, yeah? But this one is a... It's, it's, it has the resolution, yeah? So don't give me this. This can go up to 1440 pixels. But the dynamic range, it's, it's, it's insane low. And when I mean dyna dynamic range, it's uh, any detail, any, any light on the, on, the, on the front of the camera, if you have a small dynamic range, the light, it will uh, blow up the, the sensor. So you will have no details there. So that's why my microscope picture is so bad. I mean, you can't see anything. You can see only bright spots and that's all. Yeah. So we're going to review my light from before. This one. I think this is the, this is the, the best one you, what we can buy. I think I have like 120 LEDs. And uh, this one, which I bought it from uh, AliExpress. This is not an advertised video. Yeah. And this has only a few big LEDs, that's all. Okay? This is a game changer, at least for me. Because instead of spending money on a very good camera, I save a lot of money buying a cheap camera and this polarizer. You can buy two types of uh, polarizers like this, yeah? Like this, doing the same job. So, uh, you can have this, which is like a light ring, okay? Something like that, yeah, or like that. Or you can have, you can have, let me see. You can have something like that. But I don't prefer something like that from a simple reason. When you have more light sources and you have light from different direction, it will start creating shadows. And that's the last things what you want, shadows. If you check on, check on Google, polarized light for microscope, same thing, yeah? I don't prefer something like that. I know some people are using this kind of light source, but in the first place, I don't have space on my desk for something like that. And the second, I don't want shadows. Okay? So uh, let's review this. Let's test it and see how it's performing, because I was impressed, you know, I, I, I just, you know, check a few seconds, and when I see the, 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 the difference, I say, you know what, I have to start the video. <laughs> okay, so first, the light, uh, the light uh, power, yeah, from everyone, so this is full power, okay, and this one, uh, let me see, full power, so this is the one, this is the second one. I mean, we can see clearly which is the winner, yeah? Yeah, so this is 120 LEDs, and this has only a few LEDs. You can see the difference. Now the picture quality, and this is very important. Let me, let me get a, a motherboard. Let me get a motherboard. Normal laptop or MacBook, what do you want? MacBook, okay. Let's see on a MacBook motherboard. Let's get the microscope. Okay, that's the microscope. Now, let's test first the normal uh, LED ring. I 
I mean, it's not that bad. Actually, this board is black. Okay, you know what? I should get... No, this is still okay. Yeah, this is still okay. Let me grab... Let me grab uh, a bright board. Because there, there are the issues. There are problems. And a bright board... Yeah, I found it. <coughs> Let's have a look on this one. Yeah, something like that. So this is a bright board. Let me just, uh, yeah, that's, that's great. Okay, so that's the picture quality. Oh, actually now it's good. <laughs> when I want to make a video, you know, the picture is fantastic. But otherwise, it's insane. Let's see. Uh, this is quite good but you see what i mean so check on, on the top of the capacitor so actually you cannot see any details because of the dynamic range yeah so the camera is blow up by the by the light and uh, it's losing the details okay that's what dynamic range is now where can i find something bright I like anywhere, doesn't matter. You know what? It doesn't matter. So that's the picture quality of this camera. With this light, sorry. With this light. Well, now the quality is quite great, you know. Well, I'm doing a video and I'm keeping the board in a way. Yeah, I'm keeping a board on some weird way. Uh, the picture is quite bad. Okay, let's let's stay here with the capacitors. Yeah, you can see the capacitor. The capacitors are gone. Are you can't you can't see the writing on the capacitor, right? Because of the light. Okay. Now let's replace the light. So I'll take this out, and I'll come with the other one. Uh, let me put the light. Okay, so the light is on. Now I can adjust, yeah? Now I can adjust. Look, look there, look there, the reflections. So the reflections are gone. So this has a ring, so I can, actually I can adjust. Uh, let me put this on the middle. Yeah, like that. Okay. So you can see there are no reflections at all or glare. Nothing. Look at the solders. Yeah. So one more time I will spin. I will spin this. Yeah. So now you can see the picture like from the other one. Now is the picture with the light, the light how comes from the from the power source, yeah. And now I'll spin the ring, yeah, because that's how the polarized light works. I will spin the ring to cancel the light. So right now you have no reflections at all, nothing. So what do you think? Now you have absolutely, like absolutely no reflections. It's unbelievable. Like not even from the processor, which is insane. I mean, look. I mean, all reflection, what you can see, just a little bit of light and that's all. That's all what you can see from the, the, the processor. Now let me replace the light with the other one. So I took out this light. Let's come with the other one. So this is the other one. So check there. Insane. 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 You see, that's, that's a very, very big difference. It's a massive difference. Hmm.
What about the pins of this one? Yeah, let's let's try. Look at the pins. Yeah, so the pins are all too bright, right? Clearly, the pins are too bright. Yeah, so let's replace the light. So what do we think about the pins? Insane. I mean, I can adjust it to looks like uh, to looks like uh, better or normal. Boy, you know what? I kind of like it. I kind of like it, like the way. How can I cancel the the light? Huh? I mean. I know, I know that it's, a, it's it, I know your, your, what you see on the, on the screen, but what I see on the, on the microscope is crazy. It's insane. I mean, look at the, look at the solders. You can see the solders. Yeah. So look at the reflection from the, from the solders. I can cancel completely the reflections for, uh, from those solders. You can see the solders. I can spin the ring. I can spin the ring and cancel the reflection totally. You can see? That's polarized light. Now let's get the other, uh, the other uh, light ring. So that's the other one. Now you see the difference? That's the difference. That's the difference. You see, half of the solders, they are so bright, actually, they are losing details. Okay? So, this is the, the cheap light. And now the other one. And this is the other one. You see, so actually, the, the light, the reflections and the glare is completely removed. I mean, I can bring it back, you know, just to... Yeah, I can bring it a little bit back, but it's no point. It's no point because the, the picture is just perfect. It's like without light. So that's what I've seen through the microscope. Like it's the, it's, a, it's, it's the microscope without any light source. So what do you think? I mean, pretty nice. I can see each pin from that uh, from this chip. Each one. I, I even can see the dust from the pins. Yeah, like that. Incredible. Incredible. So, I expect this to work, but not in this way. I mean is so efficient because you know what i seen different reviews and i've seen people using different uh, different kind of light and i was like oh it's no space here to come and install a light and light from two different sources they all create shadows always <sighs> i can't tell you how happy i am so, uh, if you are looking to save some money like me, you can buy a cheap camera and you can buy a polarizer like, like this one. And you know how it is? You have to spin this. You see this is spinning and actually you can adjust the, uh, you can adjust the light. And the light is coming, has, a, has, has here like a ring. And it's coming and it's cancelling uh, the reflection I get are getting cancelled. Pretty impressive, right? Ah, cool. This is a cool thing. I've seen some uh, some uh, pictures and some videos, and uh, I said, okay, maybe it will do the job. But I'm I'm properly impressed. I didn't expect to be that efficient. Okay, so I'll stop now.
I'm so happy, you know, finally I do have a proper proper light and proper uh, camera on, the, on my microscope. So I'll say thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you like the video, like always. And if you want to buy it, yeah, like how I said, this is no advertised video. Go on AliExpress and you'll find there a lot, like, like this one. And actually, these one are two versions, yeah? So you have a, a one version is with a lot of LEDs. And one, I think this is the new one, which has only few LEDs, but bigger power, higher power. Okay, see you in the next one. Bye.